Just days before Christmas, Zimbabwean bus stations would normally be packed with travellers rushing to get home from neighbouring South Africa. But this year, it's much quieter. Our business is very low. Customers, uh, the passengers are not going back to Zim. And about the COVID-19, uh, COVID you know, they, they are afraid for quarantine and what, what, what is talking at the borders. Bus drivers had been hoping for a bumper festive season to help their businesses recover after borders were shut for most of last year. However, the emergence of the Omicron variant prompted Zimbabwe to announce mandatory 10-day quarantine for arrivals from South Africa in government-approved facilities at their own expense. Albert Mawere is determined to travel despite the financial pressures. You, you can't ever, uh, you can't stay maybe three years, four years, five years without seeing your parents, your difficulties. And also you've got children who are they, you see. Now you see, we must see them and they, they must see us, you see. So that's why we decided to travel now. However, for bus drivers like Augustan Chibaya, this year's Christmas season is looking grim. His firm would normally send four buses per day with up to 60 passengers during December. Now it sends one, sometimes with as few as five people on board. Yeah. Since uh, COVID started, we don't have a business. You look as you see, uh, it's very quiet. Even the booth, I have look, no business. Uh, this is uh, this uh, quarantine. This is COVID killing our business.